Hey everyone it's me Timmy Flyers Guy and I have an announcement regarding Classic Flyers Theater. New episodes will be coming September 17th exclusively on the Timmy Flyers Guy YouTube channel. So get ready for some more action-packed episodes of Classic Flyers Theater. Hey everyone, Timmy Flyers Guy here and I just wanted to remind you that the Flyers Guy's Top 10 will be returning on Monday November 4th. So get ready for more exciting countdowns exclusively on the Timmy Flyers Guy YouTube channel. Hey everybody, it's me, Timmy Flyers Guy, and I wanted to remind each and every one of you that Saturday shoutouts will officially be back on Sunday. Saturday, December 7th. You've seen a lot, a lot of great shout out videos. Beautiful women, great friends, and amazing people in my life. And also family members. So get ready on Saturday, December 7th. Saturday shoutouts will be making its return exclusively on the Timmy Flyer Sky YouTube channel. Spread the love. Alexa! Oh, sorry. Sorry, folks. I didn't mean, I didn't mean to talk to Alexa. But, um, hey, hey, everybody. It's me, Timmy Flyers Guy. And in today's vlog, I'm going to talk about the, I'm going to talk about the Sega Saturn games that I've owned and the Sega Saturn games that I've played. Now, this is going to be an abridged version because I only had my Sega Saturn for three months, for uh, about two months. And then it broke on me, so I had to get rid of it. Because I don't, I messed, I really messed it up. I did something by accident. And it's a bridge because I don't know how many I got. My Sega Saturn in May of 1996. My dad brought it home, and this was the first game. That I got from the system. This is Virtual Fighter for the Sega Saturn. I had a lot of fun with this game. It was almost like being in the arcade playing this game because I played this game in the arcade before, but never on a home console. This game was the funnest game I've ever played. This is a great fighting game. It's a fun fighting game and a great first addition to your Sega Saturn collection. Next game on the list is Virtual Fighter 2. I ended up running this game at West Coast Video. Played this game, and the graphics are even better than the first game. This with two new characters. Two new characters. Uh, Lion and... and Shin. And also the introduction of, of Durrell. This game is an amazing fighting game. Great voice acting. Great fighting styles. This game is amazing. And uh, this game is amazing. Next game on the, on the list is Virtual Cop. 
I rented this game as well at West Coast Video, and I enjoyed this game. It came with the gun, and I used the gun to use the gun to play the game. You fire it at the screen, and that's how you get past it. I played this in the arcade, and I also played this on Saturn. This is a, a fun shooting game to play. Uh, if you have two players, well, your Saturn is very really fun to play. Next game on the list is Street Fighter Alpha. Street Fighter Alpha. This is the Saturn version. A lot of people say that this is the better version. Um, I rented this game at West Coast Video. I rented this. I rented. I rented. I rented, I rented this game. I rented this game. I rented this game. I rented this game. At West Coast Video, and I had a lot of fun playing this game. This is a great fighting game to add to your Sega Saturn collection. Next game on my list is X Men Children of the Atom, another fun Capcom fighting game that I rented at my local West Coast Video. Had a lot of fun playing this one. I even beat the game one time with Ice Man. This is a pretty good game. Next game on the list is a platformer. This game is called A Stall. This game is A Stall, and this is a platform game by Tech Toy. I played this game, and there was a certain level that I could not get past, so I gave up on this game. But the graphics are great. Uh, next game, next game on my list is Defcon 5. Next game on my list is Defcon 5. I rented this at my local West Coast video. Me and my brother took turns playing this game. This is the first person shoot. This is a, this is a, this is the first person shooting. This is the first. This is the first person shooting game. This game starts out very slow, but the action really starts to pick up later. It's an alright first person shooter. Next game on my list is FIFA Soccer 96. I played this game for a soccer game. I had a lot of fun with it. And I won. I won. A championship of the team on this in this game. It's a pretty good game. Next game on the list. Next game on the list. World Series Baseball. Me, I read a, my brother bought this for the Saturday. He played it a lot. And I tried to play it, but I wasn't really good at it. It's a baseball game. Nothing much to talk about. Next game on my list is Daytona. USA, this is a great racing game for the Sega Saturn. One of the best racing games for the Sega Saturn. I wasn't really into NASCAR games, but this game is a beautiful game. The music in the game is amazing. The graphics are incredible. It's an all around great game. Next game on the list, Mortal Kombat 2 on Sega Saturn. I rented this game at my local West Coast video. I had a lot of fun with this one. This was one of the last Saturn games I played before I broke it by accident. This is a very fun fighting game. Only thing is, I don't like the loading screens. Next game on the list, is Street Fighter the movie the game? This game is Street Fighter's face off of Street Fighter the movie and uses digitized graphics like Mortal Kombat. This game is okay. Uh, it's not a bad game. I had fun playing this and I had fun around. I'm glad I ran into this game. This game is awesome. And the last game on my list is Gex. Gex is a platformer. You 
play as a lizard. I mean, it's a fact. And it's a platform game. I can make it past the first level. This was the last Saturn game that I played before I got a PlayStation. And before I, br I before the system, before I accidentally broke the system. So, Sega Saturn was a fun system. I kind of wish that I would have been a little more careful with the system. Maybe I still would have had it. But it is what it is. I still have the fond memories of this system. Even though it lasted for about two months. It's still a great system. A great system to be remembered. Um, the best thing... Uh, a lot of people say the best games on this system are the imported games. I never had a chance to import on my Sega, my Sega Saturn, but if I could go back in time, I would definitely do it. Guys, thank you for joining me, and have a great day, everyone.